Before we start, I would like to thank this month's patrons Mary, Norbert, Colin, Brad, and Nikki. Thank you so much for your support my channel. I really appreciate it. Sadiha everyone! Monday, new recipe! Today, I will show you guys how to make Thai Pattaya Salad. In Thailand, we call Som Tam. Som means orange or sour. So, sour in this case. And Tam means to pound in the mortar and pesto. And this recipe will be level 10 of spicy. Alright, are you ready? Let's go! Now we are going to peel it. By the way, I don't know in your place it is difficult to find a green papaya or not, but it is just not a red version of a regular papaya. If you notice why suddenly the sound is changed, because it's raining, so I have to put a microphone. Now we are going to julienne this papaya by shop, 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 shop. Once you have made a lot of incisions, we are just going to slice off a layer. Don't forget to wash your fingers, please. I don't want that kind of things happen. Try not to slice off too deep. We don't want it to be too thick. After we finish to care of the green papaya, now I will prepare the bamboo. This is what I cannot miss in my papaya salad. We are going to take off the hard skin of the bamboo. We need only soft part inside of the bamboo, like this one. Now it's time to make papaya salad! First, we are going to add one clove of garlic. Then, we just roughly pound it and remove the skin. Next, we are going to add chili. According to your taste, quick tip for papaya salad. If you really want your papaya salad spicy, very spicy, you have to pound the chili well, real well. But if you don't, just roughly pound it. Oh, and wash your eyes. Don't pound it like this. I think you should pound it like this. Use your hand, close the mortar like this and then pound. After chili and garlic, we are going to add palm sugar. If you don't have palm sugar, you can use white sugar instead. No problem. We will cut lime or lemon. Squeeze it and then just put all the skin in the papaya salad like this. Then we will have the full aromatic from lamb in our sang. It smells good and it tastes good. Fermented fish sauce is from Isan. Tastes good. This is kind of papaya salad I really love. I love Isan style. But if you don't like it, I recommend you to use fish sauce. Then we are going to add tomato. How we cut it? Just put it on top of the mortar and just, just cut it. <laughs> no need perfect shape. No. Do it like this. Mm -hmm. Then just mix it and a little bit press. Come to the fun part. 
we are going to make the real papaya salad now. The good way to pound the papaya salad is not not pound it like this, but you mix it, you little bit press, and then you stir it with spoon like this. If you do it same as me, you will still have the crunchiness of green papaya. Mmm, it's good. Now it's done. And now let's try! I'm very happy <laughs> because I will eat papaya salad! I have to tell you first, this is a Isan version because I put fermented fish, right? But if you want to try like a Thai style, like uh, Bangkok style, something like that, or you don't like fermented fish, you use fish sauce instead. If you want to try Thai dish but a bit more at once, you have to try Isan papaya salad. Mm. <laughs> you hear that? It's very crunchy. Mm. And for papaya salad, I always eat with rice noodle. It's very going well together. Mm. Mm. As always, if you like this Isan Papaya Salad, don't forget to subscribe and click the bell to receive a notification when I add a new one. If you would like to support the channel, go check in description, I put my Patreon page there. You can share this recipe to your friends and leave me in the comment that you used to try Papaya Salad or not. And very important! Shop that like button. Thank you for watching. See you next Monday. Bye. <laughs>